Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to be opening the Champion's Path Hatterene V Collection Box. I got this box on eBay for just about $20, so around MSRP. Um, as you can see, it comes with four Champions Path Packs. You can only really see three here, but I'm sure the other one is just hiding, per usual. Um, so you open this here, you can see the Jumbo Hatterene V card. Um, you know, I don't really have a use for the Jumbo cards like most people, but I do put them on my wall, actually, as a decoration, so that's kind of neat. I'll just put that in the back here, actually. And as you can see, these packs are just falling out a little bit. We have four Champions Path. Sorry if my arm is kind of covering the camera a little bit. Still trying to figure out the best way to record these videos. And then the code card. And obviously we have the normal size Hatterene V with plunger here. Let's try to get that out. There you go. There go. So we're going to sleeve that. So, um, I haven't really opened that much Champion's Path so far. I've gotten an ETB and a uh, double V box that was not very kind to me at all. Um, let me just adjust my camera here. The packs. Okay. And I've not really gotten very good pulls from the set. I think I've only gotten regular Vs. So I'm hoping for a full art or better in this opening. So here we have our four packs. I'm just going to start on the top with the Galarian Obstagoon art. And I do not think the code cards matter. Uh, let's adjust this camera real quick. Do not think the code card color matters in the set because each pack comes with guaranteed hollow or greater. But I don't want to spoil the pack result by showing the edges there. So, green code card, green and white for the back. And starting off with the water energy into a Sonia trainer, B drill, a Milo trainer, Galarian Lanoon, Nicket, Machop, Ekans, very uh, cute Swablu, ooh, reverse grass type energy, and a holographic scent to scorch. So I'll definitely sleeve up that grass energy. I do have a reverse hollow energy collection. I do not remember if I have grass or not. But I love green, so that is a great pull for me. In my book, I'll put that back there. The scent to scorch can go to the side. I don't much care for sleeving up hollows, especially for a set that has a hollow in every pack. The next pack here. Um, still have not been able to get any Shining Fates. Um, you know, I haven't really been thinking about it too much. I haven't really been fixated on it. Because in my book, I mean, even if I can't find a certain set, there's so many sets available that um, really, you know, I don't think it's uh, important to think about it too much as, um, you know, it's one of those sets where, you know, if I can find it and I'll take it, but I'm not going to obsess over it. And we have this very cute Vulpix here. A Rockruff, Purloin, Glare and Lanoon. Let's see what the reverse, Professor's Research, and wow, the champ. Isn't that the... The meme on the Reddit, subreddit, you always get a hollow machamp. That 
that's funny. So nothing too crazy from that pack, but we will continue. This is my first time making a video opening product. You know, mostly just been kind of wanting to, uh, I'm just going to open the pack off screen here. I don't want to, I think I keep showing the edges of the cards. I don't want to look either. I don't want to spoil there's something good in the pack. Um, so I'm just going to do the card trick off camera here. And get it all situated. And here we go. So we have a fire energy. Because I don't know if you guys care, but one of my pet peeves is when I'm watching a pack opening and they keep showing the edges of the cards. And it's like, I already know there's nothing in this pack. Beedrill, Rotom Bike, Ekans, Weedle, Galarian Lanoon, Scraggy. Of course, kind of seeing the same commons over and over again here because of the set of Champions Path is quite small. Roly Coley. Ooh, Reverse Victini. That is a uncommon, not a rare, and Lycan Rock. So, three out of four here, we've gotten Hollows. So, not the best luck. Kind of what I've already been experiencing and getting used to with Champions Path. Um, and obviously the card you're looking for in this set is the Charizard, or Charizards, I should say. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you guys have had some great pulls from Champion's Path, you can talk about them in the comments. Hopefully this last pack can give me some luck. I would love... A full art Gardevoir, full art Charizard, any kind of um, secret rare card like that, or ultra rare. I'm just going to open the pack off screen to avoid any spoilers. And um, hopefully we can get that last pack magic and get something good out of this box other than the Hatterene V. But we will see. So, starting off this pack, we have a Lightning Energy. And moving into a Sharpedo. Um, you know, we're going to take it slow on this pack. You know, I want to savor this, so look at this Sharpedo. You know, always like Sharpedo. Suspicious Food Tin. Let's. Well, an interesting card. What does it do? Heal 80 damage from one of your Pokemon that has at least one Psychic ener Energy attached. If you healed any damage in this way, discard a Psychic Energy from it. Okay. Pokemon Center Lady. Heal 60 damage. Pretty typical. Roly Coley. Zigzagoon. Weedle. Purloin, Pokeball, Reverse Team Yell Grunt, and are we going to have something here? Oh, no. A Holographic Scrafty. So, basically, this box is a bust. Um, but, you know, it's fun to open some packs once in a while. Um, my luck as of late, just as a whole, has been pretty sour, except for a, um, the exception of a Shiny Star V box I opened not too long ago, which of course has some great pulls in there. I managed to pull the Full Art Marnie, as you could see in my collection video. That was a Korean box. So from this box, we've gotten the Hollow Machamp. Honestly, looks cooler on the camera than it does in real life. Same thing with the Centiscorch. Do like that kind of volcanic background, though. The Scrafty. Looking around the town plaza at the fountain. Some buildings. A beautiful Reverse Hollow Grass Energy. And lastly... 
the Hattering V promo, which I knew I was going to get from this box. So, that is it for this video. Uh, if you liked it, you know, you go ahead and like it. If you didn't, whatever. If you want to subscribe, go ahead. I um, should be getting some more things either end of this week, beginning of next week. So those you might be able to see and should be some pretty interesting openings. And I'll just tell you that. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and uh, see you guys next time. Bye. Oh, and just as an afterthought as I was finishing up this video, I also got the Lycan Rock Hollow, so add that to the pull count. Alright, so I kind of just decided on a whim here to include a recording of me opening the digital packs as well. Um, so, I just decided to do this kind of because, you know, if I didn't get anything from the actual box, you know, might as well record my online luck. If we can get any, there's a Zygarde. Um, I do play the online TCG game semi-frequently. So we have a Marnie there, that's not too bad. Let's see what we can get in our second to last pack. Scorch. got that one from the actual box as well. And last pack, we have a... Ooh, Alchemy V. I have actually pulled this one um, from a real pack as well, so that's that's neat. I don't think I had it. Or yeah, I guess I did have it uh, in the online if there was no new symbol. We can check here. Go to um, Champion's Path V. Yeah, we, no, we only had one. That's new. So, cool. Um, so yeah, that's uh, all I wanted to do at the end here. So thanks for watching and hope you have a great day.